Today's question is, what are all the tests that we require when on a vegan diet? And how often should they be repeated? So first of all, I want to say that a vegan diet is not a disease. And so the tests which anybody needs are the same tests which a person on a vegan diet needs. And I generally recommend a list of tests which you can see if you go to our website and look under consultations because every single consultation requires to have all these tests done for our consultations. So what are these tests? CBC which checks the white blood cells, red blood cells and other things in the blood, CBC and then liver function test, kidney function test, lipids which checks cholesterol and triglycerides, HbA1c which looks in for diabetes thyroid function test because so many people have thyroid issues these days and then vitamin B12 and D which must be checked these are the tests which must be checked for every single person anyway and sometimes in India I recommend Thyrocare's Arogyam 3 and that's only because these tests are relatively inexpensive and so it's easy to do again and again when you do this but it's not necessary. You can do it from any good laboratory. Now, if your tests are all normal, you don't need to keep doing them again and again. You can repeat them once a year or once in two years. But if you have any issues in the test, then you would want to repeat them depending on how soon you, your doctor feels those issues can be better. For example, if you go on a whole plant-based organic diet and you have thyroid issues the TSH levels may come down in three months so you would want to check it every three months or if you have vitamin B12 and D deficiencies then you want to check again in three months whether it has actually risen after the supplements so it all depends on what are the issues and when we expect them to get better and whether they are life threatening or not for example if your cholesterol is high you don't need to keep checking because if you're on a plant-based diet you're not consuming any cholesterol so you can just wait a whole year before you check again so i hope this helps and remember although i'm trying to let you know as much as i can through these questions it's really important if you have any issues to take a consultation with sharon doctors because we're helping so many people get healthy again <music>